Hi, welcome to Construction Point. My name is Yoshibe, and today I'll be showing you how to check whether your column is vertically placed okay for your casting. We have these columns here. Um, want to check to know whether it is vertical enough for us to place our concrete to make sure that our column is not bent this way or bent this the other way. So we're making use of this instrument called plumb bob. This instrument is weighing 5 kg, that's 500 grams. And then with the help of this and my tape, I'll be checking whether this very column here is straight or not. So follow me as you see what I do now. Right, help me bring this block. Just put on the ground. <laughs> oh, I'm not trust him. Come on for us. I want my album. So, the first thing I'm going to do is not free. Is to make sure that this central wood is centralized. And now it's now time for me to use my tape. With the help of this tape now, I'm going to check the measurement at the top here. And I'm also going to check the measurement at the ground. Once the, the measurement at the top and the measurement at the ground is the same. It means that the column is plumb in this side, this side of it. Once I finish doing that here, I will also do the same thing at the, the other side. So now, let me check what it is at the... We've confirmed that at the ground here, we have 28 at dot. We have 28. The plumb bob must be suitable. So here we have we have 27.5. So now we are going to push a little from this side to get it. So we hold the plumb bob to make sure it's stable. This is 27.5 this is 27.5 so 27.5 27.5 let me see check up to confirm that is 27.5 this is very correct so Nell So now, I'm going to show you a proof that that both the up here and the down here is equal. So, but before then, let me check it now and show you that the up and the down is equal, showing that this side of the column is plumb. So here now you see that the the plumb bob is nearly steady. If you check now, you see twenty-seven. 27.5 at dot. Now we come up here also. We put our tape. We see see that it is 27 27.5. So it's showing that that means that this side of the column is properly plumbed. So now we're going to plumb this side of the column now so remove the plumb bob centralize it 
So now, shift it, push it back a little. Yes, push it, push it again. Push it a little. Okay, it's okay. You can come down now. So now, I'm going to also check here to make sure that this side is also plumb. Please shift the block here so that I'll be able to use it and check. So before then, we are going to make our slipper steady by nailing where we are going to nail our brazen to. So, you can see, we are nailing our slippers down. We are nailing our slippers down. So that once I check it and confirm that the two sides are equal, I will tell them to nail. So they can nail immediately. So now, I'm going to check at the up first, as usual, before I will check down. Once the measurement is equal, it means that the column is plumb at this side of it. So I must make sure that my plumb bulb is suitable, is steady. I'll make sure it's steady. It's almost steady. So now I'll check. At this point, I have um, I have 21 adults. I have 21 cm at the top. So here now I'll be checking to make sure I have 21 cm. So I'll use this end here. So here I have I have 22 or 21.9. That's what I have. I have 21.9. So it means we are going to push it a bit. We are going to push it a bit. So push, please. Push. Stop. Release it more. Release it a little. Okay, it's okay. This is, you see now, we have 20 adults. Yeah, Nell. What do we have before now? We have 20 or 21. Release it. We have 21 then. We have 21 then. So now, we should have 21 as well. Release it more. Release it. A little. A little, please. Release more. It's okay. Exactly at 21 now. So we can nail. Nail. So now we have we have our DC nailed at 21. So we nail it at the two brazen. We have a cross brazen here. We are linking this column to this one. So both of them are very, very suitable. This one we have we have plumbed this one. So this one now we've plumbed it. So we want to check now to confirm that. The measurement down is the same measurement up. So our addition is dangling, so we'll make it steady. So we have, when we check it here now, you see, it's exactly at 21. So we check up. We check up here. Yeah. You see, it's at 21 as well. So it then means that our column have been properly plumbed. So we are free to cast. Please, can you shift there? We are free to cast now. So this is how to plumb your column when you want to confirm that your column is vertically okay or vertically all right. As you can see, this side of the column is we've plumbed all of them. So you can use this technique to plumb. Even during casting, you can use the same method to reconfirm. To reconfirm. One more thing. Whenever you want to, whenever you want to buy plum bob, this plum bob, it's important to note one thing. The good thing with this is that the lighter it, the lighter it is, the less accurate it becomes. So it's advisable to buy a very weighty one, like this is a. 500 gram that's five kilogram so it's very very weighty so the accuracy level is very very high so try this and then send um if you haven't subscribed to our channel subscribe and click the notification button as we'll be always updating you about what is happening at site thank you for watching